remember the first time you told me, well, you can just like not log a meal sometimes, or you can just shoot for calories one day. And I remember thinking like, what? <laughs> Concept of being pretty good most of the time. That was very new. Not what the nutrition space preaches. Here's what you need to do. Here's the rules that you need to follow. And I think sometimes we latch onto that of if I, if I just know exactly what to do and I just have these rules, that'll fix everything sending you further down a dark hole of an unhealthy relationship with food. Because actually, I thought it was, oh, I'm supposed to hit my macros perfectly every day, and that's what's going to fix this. And then I think the more we work together, the more I realize like, why I behaved the way that I did with food was due to all these things in my past. I really loved listening to this interview because it highlights certain things. Like, you don't need to be perfect all the time to get any results and that many people look for macros or specific amount of calories to eat and this can be educational but you know we are human beings we are not computers you have emotions and this influences how you behave around food some people don't know how 20 grams of protein looks like and even those who do often struggle because they separate emotions and macros they don't know how to eat 